Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back to another vlog. Today, I honestly, I'm just feeling kind of like yuck. I feel kind of bleh. This is how I describe things in my brain. I don't know if it's making sense. But um, we came back from Joshua Tree yesterday. And so, you know, we were just in the, in the car for a lot of the day. I didn't sleep great the night before. I didn't sleep great last night. And then uh, it's a Monday. So I woke up and I just... Ugh. So that's where I'm currently at, but I thought it could be fun to vlog like my reset day today, kind of trying to get back into routine. I need to get groceries. I need a meal plan. I need to unpack. I have quite a bit of work to do. So much footage to organize from the trip. Two vlogs to edit, endless emails, and uh, not gonna lie, it stressed me out quite a bit when I first sat down at my desk, but um, such a blessing. Grace is sleeping in. She woke up to feed at like 7.15, I think. Went back to sleep. It's now 10.06 and she's still sleeping. So I got my email under control. I organized the footage. I also, I'm filming a main channel video this week of like what I actually wear in a week. So I'm, I'm showing every single outfit starting today. So I filmed my comfy little workout outfit, drank a ton of water. I filled this up three times already today. I feel a little bit more centered now. I feel ready for the day, ready for Grace to wake up and ready to just kind of get things going. So I'm just gonna sit here and keep editing <laughs> until she wakes up. And then we're gonna go on a walk, go to the park, get some fresh air, try to get back into the swing of things. Oh my gosh, I'm so winded. <laughs> but we made it, we're at the park. Brought some toys with us, a book. This is a cow. Moo. <laughs> Moo, you wanna hold the cow? So we're gonna enjoy some sunshine, some fresh air. And then I need to remember on the walk back to get some B-roll for the main channel video. I feel like if I just show every outfit in the mirror in the morning, that's kind of boring. So I want to get like some different shots, you know, what I'm doing, actually wearing each look. So we got to do that. Moo. Moo. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, for Grace, it's for you. They want to talk to you. Also, uh, I think I mentioned this in the last vlog, but Grace can now move herself from uh, sitting to on her stomach and vice versa. Girlie is getting more mobile by the day. Yeah, you were able to go from sitting to laying down over here, pulling on the grass. Let's not eat the grass though. <laughs> All right, we are back home now. Um, we had lunch, played for a little, and then it was time for Grace to nap again. So I just put her down. She's not asleep yet, so I'm just watching her on the monitor, but she usually falls asleep within like five or 10 10 minutes of me putting her down. So hopefully she'll fall asleep soon. I'm just gonna chill on the couch with the dogs until I know she's like for sure asleep and doesn't need me to go back in there. And then once she's down, I'm gonna start uh, the big list that I made of the things I would like to get done today. Bella, don't lick my mouth. So I wanna shower. I wanna like do a full wash and detangle of my hair. I wanna make my meal plan and grocery list for the week. I wanna unpack from this weekend uh, for both me and Grace. I wanna tidy the kitchen because it's a hot mess. I have some clean laundry for Grace to put away. And then um, maybe go to the grocery store when she wakes up or maybe just wait until tonight, like literally late tonight after she's asleep. It'll be easier to grocery shop if I wait tonight, but then like it'll be kind of late and I'm gonna be tired. The later in the day that I wait to do the grocery shopping, the bigger the risk that I don't end up getting to it. So we'll see. But uh, for right now, it's just me and you and you. got the laundry put away. I made it through most of my to-do list, um, but I still haven't done the grocery list and meal plan. I can't believe it's already four o'clock. Steven uh, gets off work in an hour. So definitely gonna save grocery shopping for tonight, which means the next hour, we just get to have fun. Should we have another Encanto dance party? Ooh, or do you wanna go in the ball pit first? Okay, here's what I'm thinking. Ball pit, snack, 
<laughs> Encanto dance party. All right, it is the evening now. I'm definitely losing steam, but um, after I finish this grocery shopping, I don't have anything else to do tonight. I'm just gonna chill out, maybe play some video games, watch a movie with Steven. I did eventually get to make my list, my meal plan, but right now my shopping list is all in order by like meal, if that makes sense. So I decided what I was gonna make and then for each meal wrote out the ingredients. So actually before I go inside, I'm gonna take a couple minutes here and just organize it so that it's in the order of the store layout so that I can get you know all the veggies at the same time all the dairy products all the shelf stuff that way i'm not forgetting things and hopping around the store so i'm gonna do that all right got my reusable bags got my grocery list boom let's do this all right we're gonna start off with all of the produce on my list honestly grocery shopping at night is kind of peaceful it's very empty all right got all of my produce now i'm gonna get the uh, non-perishables the shelf stuff all right done with that um except i still have to get bread and pita but that's right by the exit so i'm just gonna do that on my way out so now dairy i got my greek yogurt i go through this stuff just so fast and then steven prefers the single serve flavored yogurt so i got that for him and then milk grabbing my bread and uh we're out of here that was actually really quick oh i just remembered i need parmesan and it was not on my list back up all right we got the parm we got all the bread things and we are done yay they don't call him one trip steve for nothing <laughs> All right, back home. I was gonna say you helped me unload, but you just unloaded the entire thing in one trip. But yeah, how was your uh, your work day? It was good. It was very productive. Good. I am actually gonna go back upstairs to finish up some stuff. Okay. But um, once I finish that, I'll be down to come down and watch some TV. Yes. Maybe like Hawkeye. Yeah, we still have to finish Hawkeye. We're close to finishing it. And honestly, I'm not a big fan. It's just, it's not up to par for me so far, I'll say, with yeah. the other Marvel shows that they've done. Yeah. I, can, I do agree, but I do. I just want to finish it. Yeah, no, me too, me so. too. And then we get to start what I'm really excited for, which is Book of Boba Fett. So I'm gonna put these groceries away. You can go finish your work, then we'll do that. Um. Oh, other thing that is very exciting. While I was at the grocery store, I closed my rings for the day. Oh, well, which is the whole month. Yes, today's January 31st. So that means I got a perfect month with my Apple Watch rings. Totally arbitrary, but it does feel like a little win for me. So yeah. I'm I'm glad that I finished out the month. Yeah, I think it's funny when you're, like, you're editing and hear like your standing desk go up. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm like, ah yes, gotta get that standing hour. <laughs> there we go. Camera angle's a little crooked, but I had to do it one hand yeah. since I'm holding Miss Grace here. Um, but it's actually two days later now. About to make some breakfast for me and Grace. Yes, I am. Hi, little Gracie. Is that your dada? <laughs> Heading up to work. Yep. All right, say bye, dada. Kiss for mommy. Mm. Kiss for baby. Mm. Forehead for mama. Mm. <laughs> We're headed for Gracie. Mm -hmm. Love you, girls. Say bye bye, Dada. Have a good day at work. All right, we got breakfast ready yogurt bowls with fruit and granola for me, and also a scrambled egg for Grace. Oh, almost forgot. Last topping some chia seeds. Now we're ready. <laughs> so today is Wednesday. I'm going to be with Grace for most of the day. And then in the afternoon, my brother's going to come hang out with Grace, watch her for a little bit so I can get some work done. And today is the day that both Kenzie and Jess are working in person. So that's always really fun because we get to be more collaborative, get to have some social interaction. It's really fun. <laughs> but before any of that, it's just you and me and our yogurt bowls. Mmm. <laughs> All right, I got Grace all cleaned up, got her dressed, brushed her teeth, combed her hair, and now uh, she's doing some time in her jumper. Yes, cuteness. <laughs> also, Grace's hair is getting so long, and also I think it's starting to get a little bit of a curl to it. Do you have a little curl, bouncy girl? <laughs> all right, while she has fun in there, I'm gonna try and clean up all of these toys so that things are uh, nice and neat and tidy when Jordan gets here. All right, one, two, three. There we go. Grace is just getting an absolute kick out of Steven right now. Wow, so pretty. <gasps> is that Gracie? <laughs> oh yeah, it's a good day. <laughs> is that Gracie? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now you gotta say bye-bye for real to Dada. He's going into the office. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. 
All right, it's a bit later, about noon now. Just got Grace down for a nap. <laughs> Finally cleaned up the breakfast mess. And I'm actually gonna get started on lunch. Um, what I'm making today has to roast in the oven for quite a while. So I figure I can start it now, then while it's roasting, hopefully get some work done up in my office. Then Grace will wake up and then we can eat. I'm making a new recipe, another one from TikTok. <laughs> my goal has been to try one new recipe every week. And then if it's something that I like that works for Grace and I, I can add that into our regular meal rotation. And the new recipe for this week is, hold on, let me get my phone. <laughs> this Thai style veggie burrito. I thought it looked amazing. <laughs> I'll link the recipe TikTok in the description if you wanna try it out for yourself. Seems right up my alley. All vegetables I like, all flavors I like. Okay, so I prepped my sweet potato and onion. But I still have to chop up the cauliflower and the broccoli, so I'm gonna do that and then add it to the sheet pan. All right, there we go. This is so pretty and colorful. <laughs> also, um, there was some extra cauliflower, so that's just gonna go in the fridge for later. Now I'm gonna drain and rinse this can of chickpeas and add these to the sheet. All right, wait, hold up. I just checked the recipe and it's actually two cans of chickpeas, so I'm gonna add these two. Mix it up. All right, now I'm gonna add the spices, so turmeric, paprika, coriander, and cumin. Also salt and pepper, some oil, and I'm sectioning off this little area for Grace uh, without salt. All right, so now this is going in the oven. The TikTok said to roast it at 400 degrees for 30 to 45 minutes. All right, now while that roasts, I am gonna run upstairs and do a little production meeting with Kenzie and Jess, plan out the sponsored Instagram photo that we're taking later today, and the next video that we're filming next week. All right, glasses on, laptop open, <laughs> water in my mouth. <laughs> that was a really weird way to say that, but a uh, reminder to hydrate today. <laughs> All right, we've got Jess, we've got Kenzie. I just showed you my computer screen, which I mean, I could edit out, but maybe we'll leave that in as a little Easter egg for new merch that's coming. <laughs> oh my gosh, back to the food. <laughs> it smells amazing and I think it's cooked perfectly. It's been in there for about 38 minutes. It's nice and brown and crispy, but like not burnt yet. So I think I'm gonna take it out. All right, now we're gonna make the sauce, which is peanut butter, limes, garlic, tamari, oil, maple syrup. And now I'm gonna mix this all together until it's smooth. Also, there's supposed to be ginger, but I do not have any. So it's just gonna be this, which seems kind of a, like a strange concoction of flavors to me, but I love trying new things. So I'm, I'm excited to see how it tastes. Now I'm gonna heat up some of these tortillas in the oven and then we'll assemble. And then my brother got here and he was on a work call in the living room so I didn't want to disturb him I'm just gonna voice over the rest I took out Grace's quarter of the veggies and I left the cauliflower and the broccoli flowerettes full mashed up the rest of the veggies and gave her some tortilla pieces then I added the veggie mixture to the warm tortillas with the peanut sauce and some cilantro and attempted to fold the burritos but failed pretty miserably <laughs> I think I need bigger tortillas and also I just don't know how to fold a burrito so uh, please feel free to correct my burrito making form in the comments. I welcome it. And this made eight burritos, so I wrapped the rest of them in tin foil and then put them in the freezer. Oh my gosh. Let me take a couple more bites. I don't I don't want to jump the gun, but oh my gosh, is this delicious. <laughs> I made one for Jordan as well. Jordan, what do you think? A plus. A plus, he says. Grace, I think it's an A plus too. <laughs> All right, I think I can officially say with food in my teeth, I'm sure. <laughs> this is the best TikTok recipe I've ever tried. Maybe one of the best recipes I've tried ever. This is absolutely going in the rotation. Grace seems to like hers too. And they're designed to be freezer burritos so they can stay in the freezer for up to six months. They reheat really well, supposedly. Literally savoring every bite. It's so good. For real, if that was something that I got at a restaurant, I would drive to go back to that restaurant just to get that. So freaking good. And I have a bunch in the freezer too. So that's great. We love leftovers. <laughs> so now Jordan has tapped in with Grace. He's downstairs with her. She woke up in just like the most wonderful mood. So I think today is gonna be a really fun day for the two of them. I'm gonna try and get some work done before we head out to take the sponsored Instagram photo. All right, checking it again. It is now three o'clock. I did get a good chunk of my computer work done, but I'm gonna pause now. I have to film a 
clip for the main channel video and then at 3.30 I have a very exciting phone call. Actually it's a video call, it's FaceTime, but <laughs> I'm gonna try and do a main channel video where I have my closet professionally organized and there's a woman who I went to high school with who has a professional organizing business in San Diego and so I always see like her business stuff on Instagram and it just seems really really cool. So today we're doing like a consultation call and I'm gonna show her my closet, what kind of talk about things, budget, all of that. And I'm also gonna be filming that for the main channel video, which probably won't be out until maybe like April. I think I think it's gonna be a pretty long process, but I'm excited about it. I feel like that's gonna be super, super cool. Then we're gonna head out, take the sponsored Instagram photo. I think we're gonna take it at a coffee shop, so that'll be just like a fun little outing too. And then once we're wrapped with filming and stuff, Kenzie and I are going to do a little workout together, so that'll be really fun. home now. Um, today was great, especially ending the day with a workout with Kenzie was really, really nice. We've been saying for a while that we want to start like just doing more workouts together. And so we wanted to try out like a couple different gyms and stuff to see what works best for us. And I think this gym was really great. It was also really inexpensive. There was like an outdoor area. We both really enjoyed it. It was really fun. Um, it's about 8 p.m. now. Steven just went upstairs to play some video games. And I think I am going to take a bath with one of my bubble bars. Oh, actually, no. You know what I should do before? that is I should go upstairs and organize all the footage from today. Since I was filming for the vlog and the main channel, sometimes it gets confusing for me like which is for which if I don't do it right away because I forget. So I should do that now. Then I'm going to take a bath and then um, around 9 30 Steven's going to come back downstairs and we are going to start Book of Boba Fett which I am so excited for. <laughs> which um, I think was in this vlog that we were talking about how we I, I at least didn't really like Hawkeye so far. We finished Hawkeye and I have to say episode six and also kind of episode five totally turned the show around for me. Like every little thing in the first couple episodes of the show, like was worth it. Cause we got the big payoffs at the end. I really did like it. Still kind of stand by the first four episodes of the show being pretty boring. I shouldn't say boring, just not, not my thing. <laughs> but the last bit of the show I loved, I think definitely worth the watch even just for that last episode. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.